In this video, we listed the 5 best popcorn makers on Amazon. For the price, and other details, links available in the description. The best products. Presents. Using the Salvary Popcorn Popper is super easy. First, expand the popcorn popper. Next, add one quarter cup or fill to the bottom line with your favorite popcorn kernels. Next, place the lid loosely inside the bowl. Use the two handles to place in the microwave and cook for two to four minutes. Carefully remove the popcorn popper from the microwave and enjoy a healthy snack. Toppings optional. The Salbury Popcorn Popper features a collapsible, space-saving design, is made from food-grade silicone, is dishwasher safe and comes in an assortment of colors. Salbury. Traditional quality, modern design. This is the Dash Turbo Pop Popcorn Maker. Make delicious bowls of popcorn in minutes using only hot air. Typical microwave popcorn is loaded with preservatives, dyes, artificial flavor, and a butter-like goo. But don't fear, the Turbo Pop Popcorn Maker is here. The Turbo Pop Popcorn Maker cyclones superheated air around the kernels to evenly pop up to eight cups of fresh popcorn. Plus, you can also use the kernel measuring cup as a melting tray for butter or coconut oil. Unleash your creativity with the included recipes for caramel corn, cheesy cheddar or s'mores popcorn, or just enjoy it with a pinch of salt. Make fresh, unprocessed, delicious popcorn today with the Dash Turbo Pop Popcorn Maker. An amazing idea in popcorn popping. Optimal popping performance combined with fun popping action. Orville Redenbacher's Fountain Hot Air Popper makes great tasting low-fat popcorn with virtually no unpopped kernels. It's easy to use. Pour a half a cup of popcorn into the popping chamber and flip down the stainless steel restrictors. They keep kernels that have not yet popped in the chamber, so almost every kernel pops. Then put on the cover and plug it in. Hot air, not oil, creates a fountain of popcorn. Pops up to 20 cups in about three and a half minutes. Prefer smaller batches? Pop as little as five cups in about two and a half minutes. When popping is done, snap on the lid, flip over, and presto! The cover doubles as a serving bowl. Hulls drop through the built-in sifter for easy disposal. Just pop off the lid and discard the hulls. Cleanup is a breeze. Because corn pops with air rather than oil, there's no greasy mess. Base and cover simply wipe clean. The Orville Redenbacher's Fountain Hot Air Popper by Presto. Hi, I'm Mary Rogers, and this is the Cuisinart Easy Pop Popcorn Maker. This version here is red, but it also comes in both black and white. It has beautiful brushed stainless body on the bottom, and you'll also notice it has an accent on the removable lid. It's capable of popping up to 16 cups of popcorn, depending on what brand you use. It has a nice removable bowl, which you flip upside down after you're done popping your popcorn, and you can use that to serve your corn. It has a removable cooking plate. There's little levers here underneath these handles, which you press and then lift up, and that removes your cooking plate. The other thing is that all removable parts are dishwasher safe, and to mount this back on, you just press again and push down, and it engages. You'll notice it has a nice nonstick cooking plate here and the stirring arm. And this stirring arm, when you turn it on, will go around and help get the oil on the popcorn and help stir it so you get even cooking. So what we're going to do now is we're going to make some popcorn. It's so simple and easy. You just turn the popcorn maker on. You'll notice the stirring arm starts. We're going to pour in the oil. It takes only about a tablespoon of oil. And then we're going to put in half a cup of popcorn. And then you'll notice how the stirring arm moves all the corn around. Now we're going to put the lid back on. The other thing you're going to do is take this lid off. And one thing I didn't mention earlier is that this lid has vents in it. And that's really important when you're popping corn because it helps the moisture escape. And when that moisture escapes, what happens is you'll get really crisp, fresh popcorn. So we're going to wait a few minutes and watch it pop.
So our corn's starting to pop and um, how you'll know when it's about done is that it'll slow down. And something I should mention is that, you know, you can do lots of things with fresh popcorn where you can control your ingredients. You can put taco seasoning on it. You can put Parmesan cheese and maybe some herbs to make it really tasty. There's also lots of other great things you can do. You can make um, caramel corn for Halloween and use your creative energy and think of lots of ways you can use your popcorn maker. The other nice thing about having a popcorn maker is that you can make multiple, multiple batches, as many as you want. It's a great item to use when you're having movie night or it's even a fun thing to do with the kids. Like I mentioned, there's lots of other ingredients that you can use just besides butter and salt. So be creative. It's almost finished. As you can hear, it's starting to slow down and you can see it's starting to fill up. So what I'm going to do is wait a few seconds and I'm going to turn it off and then I'm going to show you what you're supposed to do when it's done. So I'm going to turn it off and what happens is when it's finished popping like that, we're going to press the handles like I mentioned earlier. Whoops. First we put our lid on because we don't want to come out the bottom. So we just press the handles, turn it over. I'm just going to give it a little shake. Remove this. This can go right in the dishwasher with your um, other removable parts. And then all you do is you add your seasonings right to the top and you can serve it right out of the bowl. So there you have it, the Cuisinart Easy Pop Popcorn Maker.